So I'm Ben. I am the well, one of the organizers for Nippy Dips and also the guy behind the social media. We've been running these now for probably about eight or nine weeks. Started off with about seven of us on the beach. As you can see today, we've been up to about 35, hoping to get to about 50 by the end of the summer. For me personally, it's just about like bringing people together, giving people something to do on a Sunday morning, whereas, you know, in other instances, they might just be sat there doom scrolling in bed or with a hangover. It's like Sunday morning, every week, 8 a.m., on the beach, in the sea, with just a group of like-minded people in a safe environment. Hi, I'm Scott, one of the organizers of Niffy Dips. And um, yeah, myself, Ben, and Ewan founded it two, three months ago now, and uh, it's going great. I think the main reason for starting something like this is it's, it's kind of tough as an adult sometimes to like meet new people, make new friends, and especially in like sort of smaller areas, um, you don't really get that chance. So I thought it'd be good, spoke to, to Ewan, an old childhood friend of mine, and Ben, who just moved to the area about starting a few community where people could just meet other people and just in a very kind of organic way. You don't have to go out and drink and sort of use that as any kind of like social lubrication to meet people. Um, this is like the option, you know, the sort of the second option, if you like, to, to doing that. So, so yeah, we meet up every Sunday and um, everyone seems to like it so far, so it's good. Cold water for me until I moved down to Devon was uh, a bit of a, I had a bit of an issue with cold water. I had a bit of a, uh, a scare with it two years ago. Um, so this has just encouraged me weekly to keep on getting in, keep pushing my limits and uh, yeah, just almost rekindle my relationship with the sea and the cold water and um, so far it's going well. Do you use it yourself? Do you use it each other? Um, that's enough. I'm freezing. <laughs> If you're scared of getting in cold water, I would say first and foremost, just take it slow, listen to your body, um, and just acclimatize. Like for me, that was, I spent a week just walking up into my waist in cold water. And then it was a week a bit deeper, a week a bit deeper. And now I'm in there swimming, getting my head under and I'm used to it. I think just don't push yourself. Don't give in to peer pressure. Don't like give in to self pressure either. Just um, take it slow, enjoy it. And um, I'm sure you create a good relationship with the cold water. It just what gets me out and it helps me de-stress from work and just energize, take on the rest of the next week. When you're in there, you, it's really hard to think about anything else other than actually being in cold water. So it's just a complete switch off. I come back to you, focusing on you, doing your breathing. And I feel like you come out and it's just a nice reset, drops the stress levels and get on with your day. So I'm actually recovering from injury. So it helps me from, uh, you know, sort of like rejuvenation basically, it helps the body reducing that inflammation. But there's actually a good to like stimulate the, the body flow. So and I really enjoy it. It's like a little bit of a shock therapy, which I really enjoy. Yeah, the benefits of it is like, it's absolutely great. Yeah, I love it. So come on down and um, meet the group. It's, uh, it's a friendly bunch of people. So uh, yeah, come on down and uh, meet everyone. Niffy Dips can be found on our Instagram page, um, Niffy Dips UK. And um, that's the best place for all the information about where we're dipping each week. Yeah, anyone who hasn't tried it yet, I'd say give it a go. I only started a couple of months ago and it just sets you up so well for the day. Um, yeah, like for a few hours after, you, you'll be feeling great.